Talk, if you will, a little bit about your tattoos and yeah. I don't know, maybe a story or two of, you know, a few of them. Definitely. I mean, I, I, you know, my first son was, well, it's been almost, it was probably 15 years ago now. I mean, mind you, I'm 49, so um, what have you. But so it wasn't an early thing and I wouldn't call it a mistake, you know, by any stretch of the imagination, but it was just a B the letter B inside of my left arm, which is there, which has now grown to be, be nice. But at the time I just put a B in there. Um, and I didn't even think about what everyone would say. They said, Oh, B for bets. I was like, well, yeah, that's my last name, but I didn't think about that at all. Not one bit. It would be for be nice, be kind, be present, be thoughtful, benevolent, you know, all of these things that I, I have these little things I say to myself over and over and over again. I'm a big believer in, in practice and, and that was just a reminder, basically, to be kind. Um, so I stuck that in there. And then um, my left arm is now completely full, but they're all with little things that have all come together. Um, one on the bottom side of my forearm is a squid, and the squid is pulling, is a cartoon squid, grabbing a ring of calamari out of a, in a you know, the, the typical... Uh, Italian red plastic basket with the red and white check paper and he's grabbing a, a ring of fried calamari um, and that's because I asked my wife Carla to marry me actually with a piece of fried calamari at Union Square Cafe in New York City um, I didn't even know it when I ordered the, the calamari it just showed up and I took a hot piece and stuck it on her finger and said will you marry me and she said yes and ate it off her finger and so <laughs> it commemorates that so it's a little goofy um I got one in or Argentina. like the most romantic story ever. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> um, I mean, I have the Lady and the Tramp. I don't know if you've seen this one. Hang on a second. There, you can see oh, them. Yeah. They're sharing. They're sharing the piece of spaghetti. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then my, I think a recent favorite. It's just my own handwriting. Um, I scribbled it on a notepad and then had them turn it into a stencil. And this guy gave it to me in Buenos Aires recently, which is never stop dreaming and um that's a big one for me that's how i pick myself up you know what, what, as we we're talking about we all those dark moments and you know I, I would be a liar if i didn't say they they don't come at some point every day but you know you get better and better at turning them away more and more quickly and for me it's just keep dreaming keep what do you want to do what's fun what's fun and and uh, so that's a tattoo. It's it's on the inside of my right arm, and I see it nonstop, which is deliberate. Mm-hmm.